Hello, I'm back again. There are different policies that you can look up. And I wanted to just go back um, to the hospital because they have different policies. And regulations. I'm going to go on to number five. When guide dogs are wearing their harness, they know they need to work and be will well behaved. They know that, and we know that. However, a guide dog can be very different when their harness is off. They can play, socialize, and relax just like any other family dog. It's also very important to never pat someone's guide dog when it is wearing its harness as a distract, distracted guide dog. I'm going to go back. It is very important to never pat someone's guide dog when it is wearing its harness as a distracted guide dog can be a safety risk for their handler who is relying on them. Six, not all dogs will graduate guide dog puppy school. Not all dogs can become guide dogs. This can be because of health reasons, behavior, or tem temperament. This does not mean that the dogs that don't graduate won't make wonderful pets. Dogs that don't graduate often stay with the owner that raised them as a puppy or are adopted by another loving family. Seven, guide dogs retire. Yes. Yay, guide dogs retire. They get to live the life. Guide dogs will usually retire from work at around the age of 10 or 11. My guide dog score is right now at age 10. So we hope that he can work for another year. Just like any dog at this age, they will often be showing signs of aging, such as arthritis. Sometimes a guide dog 
will begin to show signs signs it needs to be retired. Most guide dogs are very excited when they have their harness, but if they begin to avoid their harness and not want to put it on, it is often a sign that they are no longer up to full working life and need to be retired. When a guide dog retires, it will often stay with their owner, family, or friends. But if this is not possible, the dog is rehomed to new owners where the dogs can enjoy their hard dog where the dogs can enjoy their hard earned retirement sometimes the dog is even able to be rehomed with the original person who raised it during its puppy years before guide dog school and if you are interested in getting a guide dog there are some videos that you can watch there's also paperwork that that you need to look at and see if this is right for you there are paperwork for you to fill out there's paperwork for your doctors to fill out your physicians and your if you have um, o m instructors then they need to fill that out too but that's a whole another video in itself i hope this finds you guys well thank you again for watching and if you have any more ideas for another video um please let me know it could be about blindness it could be about guide dogs it could be anything so about life how do i how does one cope with everyday life with their guide have a wonderful evening all again thanks for watching Five percent. Eight minutes. Stop recording video. Button.